um, they funded uh, the Desert Tortoise Conversation Conservation Program in uh, Las Vegas, a habitat created in 1991. But the recession that followed dwindled the number of employees and developers and in, in turn funds for the DTCC. And then it goes on uh, to talk about how they began euthanizing them. It's a good article by Adam, but we might want to put up top. See, I'm just now reading this when they hand it to me to find the part where they're euthanizing them. Back at the conference conservation center, a large refrigerator labeled carcass freezer hummed in the desert sun as scientists examined the facility's 1,400 inhabitants to find those healthy enough to release in the wild. So they were killing them. Officials expect to euthanize more than half the animals in the coming months in preparation for closure at the end of 2014. So they got so many of these turtles, they're killing them. So there's the report. Uh, we might just say before Nevada cattle rancher uh, standoff, BLM killed, one, killed thousands of turtles, thousands of endangered tortoise. Great job on that article. Thank you so much, caller. Great points. Yeah. You're supposed to have these public lands so you can graze, you can use, you can hike. But they tell you where you can go. They tell you what you can do. And then they harass you. And then they just say, we're doing this arbitrarily. And now, oh, you can't have free speech anywhere in the county except these two little red boxes we've set up. And the governor's saying you can't do that. Clinton, Ohio, uh, you're on the air. Thanks for holding. Then Mike, Jeffrey, and Eric. Hello, yes. Uh, I'm calling in, in regard of, of the cattle rancher, and, you know, people don't realize how serious this is. I ran across a, a YouTube video. It's called Revolution in Nevada to Save uh, Clive and Bundy. And, you know, it, it's just, it's, I think the pot's getting to a boiling point, and, and the government really needs to start listening to the people because this could be the very first shot shot that around, you know, the second shot heard around the world because uh, this uh, uh, YouTube video is, is quite uh, chilling, so to speak. It's called Revolution in Nevada to Save Clive and Bundy. And well, let's post that up on InfoWars.com right now. Check the video. If it's good, guys, tweet it out at Real Alex Jones. Post it on InfoWars.com. Um, if it's calling for violence, I don't want to post it because I don't want to add to that. But uh, if, if it's a good video, we'll post it. The issue here is they've domesticated most Americans. They've gave them fluoride. They've dumbed them down. These old ranchers don't watch a lot of TV. These old ranchers aren't afraid to die. And they're what old-fashioned Americans were. They're, they're like the remnant, the vestigial remnants of men and women. And that's why the feds have always said they believe the revolution is going to start in the countryside. That's why there's a war on the rural communities to dumb everybody down or get them into the cities to control them. And um, the, a lot of these people in rural areas care more about not being slaves than they do about living. And it will come, push come to shove. And you have four or five more Ruby Ridges, people aren't going to put up with it anymore. And it won't matter how many federal buildings you blow up, feds. I mean, you know, we know you'll pick one with a daycare center so we can have, you know, dead kids on TV. People are going to see right through that when you do that. So uh, go ahead and play your hand. Thank you, Clint. Mike in Ohio, feds in the courts, uh, and then Eric, go ahead. Uh, thanks for taking my call. Um, yeah, uh, you know, oftentimes people will look at, like, this rancher situation and just, you know, kind of like, oh, well, you know, it, it doesn't affect me, and not realizing this affects every one of us. And uh, you're absolutely right in your characterization of, of the, these cattle ranchers, they are people of principle, which we don't have a lot of in this country anymore. And there's not, and especially our government does not like people to stand up for principle. My fear is with these situations, what I've seen going on uh, more and more, Alex, is, is we used to have a country of checks and balances where you can go to the courts and your rights were protected. And, and you know, the courts have even been compromised. And so, you know, the big concern I have is you really have little to no recourse because even if you can go to court, which you know the deck is going to be stacked against you, you know, financially, like the caller just said before, you could be ruined and, and everything up, you know, all sorts of other Sure, but the problem is we're already being ruined by the system anyway, so that's why it's a rock and a hard place. I hear you and I appreciate your call. Eric in Kentucky, um, you're on the air on this subject. Go ahead. Thank you, Eric. Yeah, go ahead and talk right in the telephone. Uh, yes, sir. Uh, 
Uh, expounding on your war on the rural people, uh, just look at what the, they're doing to the people in uh, Appalachia, you know, shutting their minds down um, over ridiculous EPA guidelines, which we all know are, are just a pretense to shut those industries down. But uh, people are moving into the dairy industry, and now the dairy industry is under attack by the same EPA guidelines. They're going after the Amish for selling raw milk. Can you believe that raw milk? Well, they're they're in a war against real humans. They want us domesticated. This is a total scientific takeover. Yes, sir. Yeah, I mean, what do they what do they think people's going to do? Uh, once you take away their tools, what are they going to pick up? You know what they're going to pick up? They're going to start to arming themselves. The bitter clingers. They and they they know that's all we've got left. So our Bibles and our guns. And they're telling people you can't homeschool your kids and you can't teach your kids about Christ. They're going to take that away, too. Great points. Thank you so much, Eric. Jeffrey, Pitchfork Man, Tony, everybody, your calls are coming up in the final segment straight ahead. Attention all radio listeners. Survival Life is giving away free credit card knives exclusively to our radio listeners here today. Visit MyCreditCardKnife.com to see this covert knife in action and claim yours for free. It's the same knife you've seen in the airline magazines for $29.95, but today it's yours free. Just pay shipping and handling. MyCreditCardKnife.com, MyCreditCardKnife.com. Go now. Jessica Armand here, creator of My Magic Mud, the all-natural teeth whitener and strengthening remedy that's getting rave reviews from GCN listeners. Here's what Austin dentist Dr. Griffin Cole has to say about it. I really love this Magic Mud product. Because charcoal is so absorbent, it's very effective at taking off all the sticky plaque and debris that gets stuck on our teeth every day. I highly recommend My Magic Mud. Visit MyMagicMud.com to hear the full interview with Dr. Cole. Get your jar today. That's MyMagicMud.com. Clean water at home, clean water at the office, clean water on the go. The Berkey Guy has a Berkey water filtration model for anywhere you are and one that fits any budget. Thousands of satisfied customers can't be wrong. For free shipping within the U.S., go to GoBerkey.com or call 877-886-3653. That's 877-886-3653. Helping thousands prepare since 2005, GoBerkey.com. Silver has always been nature's very own antibiotic, and only one system allows you to generate an endless supply of natural silver solutions, SilverLungs.com. You'll find no wild claims or pseudoscience, just a lifetime of nano-sized pure silver solutions. The Silver Lungs generator allows you to make your own, so stop paying for silver solutions. The unique lung delivery system targets respiratory infections where other silver solutions simply cannot reach. See the Silver Lungs generator and lung delivery system at SilverLungs.com. That's SilverLungs.com. The Victory Seed Company is a family-owned, farm-based organization working to keep rare, open-pollinated heirloom seeds available for your home garden with no unstable hybrids or GMO seeds sold. Learn about their mission at VictorySeeds.com. And for a limited time, enter Victory at checkout to receive a free garden planning tool on orders over $10. Grow your Victory Garden with Victory Brand Seeds. VictorySeeds.com. Attention gun owners, it's reasonable to assume that at some point you may need to defend your family from an armed attack. But is it reasonable to mount a defense without a strong offense? Infidel Body Armor goes on in seconds. Is civilian legal in all 50 states? Is 100% made in the USA? Is veteran owned and ships next business day for free? Go to InfidelBodyArmor.com. I-N-F-I-D-E-L BodyArmor.com. Infidel Body Armor just won't quit. We'll do a little bit of overdrive to take everybody's calls. We're going to go to Jeffrey and many others that are patiently holding. Everett is in Pennsylvania since they have info on the uh, tragic stabbing there at the school. No one's going to say blame uh, the knives. Why do you say blame a gun? Because about a third of the public's never shot a gun or been around guns, and they're scared of them. Everybody's used a knife, so they're like, no, we're not going to blame knives. I use a knife every day. They want to keep you away from it so you don't become proficient with it. The answer to them wanting to domesticate us is arming and gardening and loving and having a barbecue and inviting your neighbors over and telling jokes 
and playing cards or dominoes. The answer is going out and helping homeless people or going out for Meals on Wheels or Loaves and Fishes or the Salvation Army. The answer is getting real. The answer is, is, you know, try to stay out of fights, but if somebody starts one, stomp their head in the ground. The answer is becoming human again. By the way, this hour is brought to you by MyPatriotSupply.com forward slash Alex. At MyPatriotSupply.com forward slash Alex, you'll find all their biggest specials, and you'll find a lot of other great high-quality preparedness items. This hour brought to you by the great folks at MyPatriotSupply.com. Great customer service, organic, 866-229-0927. And uh, please don't forget, you can get PrisonPlanet.tv membership to see the nightly news. Share it with 11 people, up to 11 people. InfoWarsStore.com, InfoWarsLife.com, all the best products. ProPure Systems are the best gravity-fed filters. They annihilate the competition, and they cost the same or less. Promo code WATER to get 10% off at InfoWarsStore.com. And you're shopping with the good guys, funding the tip of the spear. In just a no apology, savage, committed to the truth, uh, all the way, Hail Mary attack on the New World Order. I mean, it just really comes down to that. We're, we're not getting into any, any maneuvers here, folks. We're just ramming the enemy straight up. And that's the end of it. Uh, Jeffrey in Michigan, you're on the air. Go ahead. Your take on this situation. Yes, sir. Uh, yeah, Mr. Bundy, I think, is cut from the same cloth as the World War II veterans in the Battle of Athens that came back from World War II and took their, took their county back in 1946 from tyrants. And although it's a different scenario. These, these oh, men, yeah. Oh, yeah. I mean, the Battle of Athens, the government wasn't even doing stuff as bad as what the BLM is doing. I mean, no one would have put up with this. That's why it never happened. These men, including Mr. Bundy, have, have that resistance that, that, like you were speaking about earlier, in their DNA, and it's right there on the surface. So they won't, they won't be walked on. Like you, you just said in his interview, we're, we're going to take our cattle back. If people know what happens when you wait and see. Um, uh, Ruby Ridge, they were they waited out, and people saw it happen. Now we have we have all the media on them, and I think that that's what real people do when confronted with with this type of of force and and tyrannical. Well, you government. get to the point where you can't help it anymore, and and it's just you know it's like when somebody walks up and punches you in the nose. I mean, you got to it, it's I want to fix this. I want to use Congress to get control uh, of the BLM, but I mean I never got to this today. The new uh, republic, you know, run by the Democrats, is bragging that the Republicans are helping keep Obamacare in place. And they just, of course, because they help write it. It's so sick, these criminals. God bless you. I appreciate your call. Pitchfork man in Arizona, your take on this, sir. Hey, Alex, how you doing today? I'm all right, brother. Hey, uh, long-time listener, first-time caller. Um, I live in Mojave County, which is adjacent to Clark County, and we suffer from the same abuses. From the BLM as Mr. Bundy, I ran. Are they rude County. to you like they are to me? They're rude to our people. They're blocking off our roads in our area where we've uh, four wheeled and ridden our four wheelers for a long time. Um, also, not so much rude, but uh, they're kind of a leech to our system. I ran for county supervisor and lost by 140 votes. I'm running for judge this next election period. But um, uh, the BLM is uh, working with the. Uh, British Petroleum to put in a wind farm in our county, and they're putting it on public land and on part of the Grand Canyon um, National Park. Oh, I know. They're going to use it with globalists to develop it, and, and that's why they want you kicked off of it. Great point. Write an article about it, and maybe we'll get you on the show. Everybody should need to, don't just count on us. There's too much happening. Talk about that. I remember seeing that in the news. Overdrive coming up. Infowars.com forward slash show of your station. Don't carry it. The globalist social engineers are not just targeting us with propaganda. They are manipulating our genetics. We are being targeted at every level by estrogen mimickers that lower our testosterone and other hormones and natural compounds that the body needs. After consulting top doctors, nutritionists, pharmacists, and others, we have developed what I believe is the ultimate non-GMO organic super male vitality formula sourced from powerful organic herbs and then concentrated for maximum potency super male vitality was developed to activate your body's own natural processes instead of using synthetic chemicals super male vitality by infowars life is so powerful that i only take half the recommended dose for a limited time 
we are offering 15% off Super Male Vitality at InfoWarsLife.com to introduce you to this powerful supplement. Visit InfoWarsLife.com today to secure your Super Male Vitality. InfoWarsLife.com. Coast to coast.